when storms of solar wind interact with our atmosphere, the result can be the magnificent light show we know as the auroras. The aurora borealis in the northern hemisphere, the aurora australis in the southern hemisphere. On October 31st, 2019, we observed the aurora borealis dance outside our window for about an hour. Our sun ejects gases and charged particles into space in all directions. This is the solar wind. The harmful solar wind reaches the Earth's protective magnetosphere in about two to four days. Most of the solar wind is deflected away by our magnetosphere, but a small percentage is channeled down lines of force in our magnetic field toward the Earth's poles. The solar wind then collides and transfers energy to oxygen and nitrogen in the Earth's atmosphere. The excited oxygen and nitrogen emit particles of light called photons in a glorious display of greens, reds, pinks, and whites. Stronger disturbances of the Earth's magnetosphere caused by the solar winds are called geomagnetic storms. The planetary K index is used to characterize the magnitude of geomagnetic storms on a scale 0 to 9. On this Halloween morning, the KP index was a 4. <laughs> 